Okay, this is the uh, third and final video, video on uh, plant adaptations. Uh, the last one is mesophytes. Uh, now, these uh, plants have a variety of adaptations, depending on the type of plant it is, actually. Um, you should know uh, about the privet hedge. Uh, that's a typical uh, mesophyte. Um, now, the, the, the leaf structure... Um, is something you've seen before. It's a typical leaf structure that we've looked at previously. Uh, so there's no um, special adaptations to speak of there. Uh, it does have stomata on the lower surface. Um, now because mesophytes uh, live in an environment where there's adequate supply of water, so they're not living in water but they're not totally dry either it's an adequate supply of water for their needs but the the plant does need to try and restrict or reduce the amount of water loss at certain times so this is where the uh, the stomata uh, come in and um, they're able to close as we know so they can close at certain times of the day to reduce uh, water loss um, that, that will enable the plant then to absorb water from the soil uh, and to sort of replenish any water that's been lost. So uh, closure of uh, stomata during the day, um, but also of course through the night. Uh, they don't need to be open really through the night, so that gives the plant the chance to uh, again uh, absorb more water without losing all of it. Right, um, so that's that's the stomata. Now, the other thing that uh, the privet does and other uh, mesophytes is they lose their leaves during winter months. Now, the loss of leaves is called uh, dehiscence. Okay, sorry, it's not called dehiscence. Sorry, it's called abscission. Um, and obviously, the winter months there could be less water around. It, it could be in the form of ice or snow. So there could be less liquid water around. So the loss of leaves by uh, abscission uh, can obviously reduce transpiration and water loss uh, that way. Okay. Um, the next sort of adaptations, uh, which the, the privet hedge doesn't do, but um, other uh, plants do. So there's there's a privet hedge with the leaf fall. Okay. Um, so that would be in the winter months and then in the summer, autumn, spring, sorry, the, the leaves will, uh, will grow back. Now other plants will um, form bulbs. Okay, now bulbs can remain in the soil dormant uh, through winter months um, so these types of plants completely lose the, the whole of their plant structure above ground that completely goes um, and the the bulb remains dormant in the soil uh, and when spring comes again the the bulb will will grow into another plant so an example of that would be like tulips and uh, daffodils okay um, the other type of adaptation is something called a rhizome. So this, this brown stuff here uh, is a rhizome. And again, it's a structure that remains dormant in the soil through the winter months, but can f reform plants when spring and summer comes. So rhizomes, again, similar to bulbs, they remain dormant in the soil and... Um, reform uh, plants when uh, the spring comes. So that's uh, the, the mesophytes, okay, and uh, again important to uh, look at some questions on uh, mesophytes as well.